Nicola Sturgeon has claimed Jeremy Corbyn is in a mess over his position on a Labour government facilitating a second Scottish independence referendum as she made clear that scrapping Trident would be another red line on securing SNP votes at Westminster. The First Minister's comments came after Labour's John Macdonald suggested a Corbyn government would not facilitate a second vote on Scotland's future until 2023 at the earliest, saying it might not agree to another referendum for two or three years. The Shadow Chancellor told Sky News' Sophie Ridge on Sunday, I wouldn't expect anything in the first two or three years because the Scottish people themselves are saying we've got to concentrate on austerity and get that sorted. We've got to concentrate on sorting out Brexit. Above all else, we've got an existential threat of climate change. That's a huge agenda, declared Mr Macdonnell. He claimed holding a second referendum would be a distraction from that and insisted there would be no change to that stance, even if the SNP made holding a referendum in 2020 a red line in post-election negotiations. But the SNP leader, who during the BBC Question Time Leaders special on Friday argued the Labour leader would not sacrifice his programme for government for the sake of denying Scotland a chance to vote on its future next year, made the same point on Sky News. She said, are they really going to turn their back on the chance to stop austerity? stop welfare cuts, get rid of universal credit just because they want to block the right of the Scottish people to decide their own future? And over a couple of years? Jeremy Corbyn is getting himself into a mess over this because his position is changing all the time and he knows within himself that the only democratic defensible position here is to say for him, he might oppose independence, he might not want there to be another referendum, it is not for Westminster to decide these things, it's for the Scottish people through their democratically elected Scottish Parliament to decide these things. That's the position Jeremy Corbyn knows is right and I don't think he is going to turn his back on all of these other things he wants to do with a Labour government just because he's so determined to block the right of the Scottish Parliament to determine the timing of a referendum, the FM insisted. Ms Sturgeon argued that a hung parliament with the SNP holding the balance of power would give Scotland maximum influence so that will be a pretty good outcome in terms of ensuring Scotland's voice is heard. She explained how her first red line would be to never ever put Boris Johnson into Downing Street, saying she had seen up close and over too many years the damage a Tory government had done to the sort of communities she grew up in. In terms of supporting A for more on this story, visit the news article link.